Hey there. And welcome to the Paul Paul Chronicles and more with Jim. Well, today what I did was I planted some persimmons. This is the more part. Now, used tree tubes or not used tree tubes. I used tree tubes on quite a few of the uh, trees that I planted over the years. And that being said, tree tubes do a very good job as far as protecting uh, the tree uh, from animals. Uh, and the tree tube promotes upgrowth. That tree wants to grow and is reaching for that light. Now, these persimmons here I started from seed, and they were open pollinated of different varieties, hybrids. So these are probably going to be a, a hybrid type uh, persimmon, and uh, we'll see how they turn out. You notice when I walk through there, I put netting over top of the uh, tree tube. Well, the one thing I'll tell you about that is, is years ago, I put a tree tube over top of a little oak and uh, I noticed it wasn't growing. I let it go for a year, but it just wasn't really putting in no, no growth at all. And then one year I decided, you know what, I'm going to take the tube off the following year and see what's going on. And when I did, there was a bird down in there that had died. And when it died, it emitted, uh, I guess, methane gas and uh, it choked that oak completely out. In the end, I ended up taking the oak out because it was just knocked back so badly that uh, it, it wasn't a good uh, candidate to grow. Now, I haven't really gotten into persimmons, but I had decided to get into persimmons and try to be closer to uh, where I am with the pawpaws. Uh, I've been growing trees for quite some time. About 15 years and mostly chestnuts nut trees but here in the last few years I started with pawpaws and yes I do have persimmons but I grew them in the back for the idea of attracting deer which I have deer being attracted out back now it's time for me to try to get into different varieties of persimmons of course this one right here and the rest of them when they grow I'll end up uh, grafting into them more than likely with a variety that I will know what it is. Uh, I was advised though whenever I looked at all my seedlings to stay away from the persimmons that had red leaves uh, on the tips. Stick with an extremely green leaf uh, because the red tipped leaf from my understanding from what I was told by an individual is going to be your Virginiana uh, American persimmon, which these are probably American also, but they've been bred and they've been uh, grown out to be particular varieties. But like I said, this is not going to be a particular variety because it's an open pollinated persimmon. Well, one thing I did find that I hadn't really re recognized with the persimmons that really, really surprised me was when I took them out of these pots, uh, down in the bottom of the pot, there was so much root fiber going on down in there, it wasn't funny. I'm not accustomed to that. I'm accustomed to uh, a tree growing a, a long tap root, and then that tap root gets broken off in the system of this potting, uh, in this potting system. And uh, I, uh, I didn't see that, that large tap root that I'm accustomed to seeing inside of uh, uh, when it comes to pawpaw. But I did see an awful lot of root fiber down here in the bottom. So what tells me that uh, persimmons is probably a tree that extends an awful lot of root mass and it must collect an awful lot of nutrients in the ground, which by the way, this area right here, we, we've been blessed with very good ground. It's just something that I wanted to share with you. I planted this in here in a fence and I've done that with other species of trees to see the results. Normally what I'll get is what's in the tubes will grow up quicker. What's in the cage, they won't grow up as quick, but they pick up more girth, more spread. And uh, I wanted to see how it would do with the persimmons. I've done it with other trees. 
Anyways, my name's Jim. If you like what you see, subscribe. Don't forget to click on that bell for notifications. Any comments or questions that you may have, I welcome. Y'all have a God-blessed day.